Yo, yo, this is Vern Bang. Recipe slangin', muck bangin' it out. Not a pro or a hoe. We're gonna be bangin' it out in this episode. Chisel and nizzle. Wigtastic, it's magic. Spillin' the tea on some of them episodes. It's your boy, Vern Bang. And that's why cooking from my soul is the way I go. On this multiple mukbang channel. We'll be back for more episodes. Shizzle me nizzle, hizzle, kizzle. Hey y'all, how's it going? This is Burn Bang, and we're back, back, back. With another episode, baby. Just for you, just for you, you. Yeah, you back there. Uh huh. The one. Uh huh. Yes, all of y'all. We back with another episode, honey. So, anyways, hopefully you are having a beautiful, beautiful day. I know I am. Let's go ahead and get into a little prayer. Lord Jesus, thank you for this day. Thank you for everything you do in our life, Lord. I just want to pray for everybody in the whole wide world, Lord. You know their hearts. You know their needs. And let's just say a little extra prayer for the people that need it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Yes. So, we got something delicious today. Yes, honey. So, we got a uh, chicken, bacon, veggie mix. It's got broccoli, kale, um, radicchio. It's got spinach. It's got... Uh, Onions, it's got uh, uh, black olives, girl, she got carrots, she got everything. So that's going to be our, like, our meat greens today. We got our greens. <laughs> we got some little uh, turkey skin. And then we have uh, salsa verde mole. So we got the salsa verde mole or the mole verde, either which way. It'll work. So yeah, we got that on some turkey. And we got cheesy rice. Yes, honey. Little Cajun style cheesy rice. So anyways, hopefully y'all having a beautiful, beautiful day. Which I probably already said that already. And I know I'm having a fabulous day just because it is all this good food that I just finished cooking. You can see it nice and popping hot. But... I had a very, very good friend from the bottom of my heart. Thank you, thank you. I'm sorry the label's a little messed up because uh, the cappy cat broke, broke, and some spilled out. So, anywho. But yeah, that's why she's a little messed up. <laughs> but her than that, she good. I, I've already had some sample sample. I've been trying to shake her. Shake her up a little bit. But we're going to get a good taste of what she really tastes like. Because I just had a, you know me, me and sauces and hot sauces, I got to, I got to get a good taste on it. So, we're going to go ahead and pour. Some on this side. We're going to pour some on this side. And pour some on this side. And give her a good taste. But yeah, the flavor is impeccable. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Love that flavor. I love that good vinegar bite. I love that good vinegar bite. So anyways, please go check out Lips. It's L-L-I-P-S, Living Life in Positive Serenity. You probably already know who he is. He's part of the Mukbang Bulls. And um, I do a lot of the challenges as well. So I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. For sending me your hot sauce. That's awesome. And um, uh, also, um, go check out his store. I'm going to link in my, uh, not my description, but in my uh, comment that I pin. I'm going to link his channel, his store, and we'll put a couple links of other videos up there that will pop up. That way you know you ain't going to get lost, honey. No way you're not going to get lost and not be able to find where Lips is. But yeah, that's gorgeous. I love it. We'll put 
her right here because uh, you could, should be able to still see her, and uh, we may need some more. I know, I hear it. Burn! Shut up and eat! <laughs> Alright, y'all. Come on, get a bite. It's got lips on it. Ooh, get a big steamy bite. Get that burn bang bite, baby. Cheers, y'all. Mmm, mmm, mmm. OMG. Yeah, I made turkey breast today. I got a whole big turkey. Of course, you know we got Michael. and she's on uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> mm. Hawaiian punch, <laughs> sugar free baby. Yeah, Hawaiian punch, sugar free, and it's tasty. It's just a little package you get at Walmart, Dollar Tree, or whatever. Look at that. I already know. O M G. You see that? This is so good. Cheers, though. Come on. Get your bite. Mmm. On the end. Let's get us a. We get us a good taste. Get that lip smacking good. All right. I heard somebody say, Hey, I want more lips. Hmm. And then I dropped it. Hey! Drop it like a cop. Drop it like a cop. Drop it like a cop. It is funny. Dropping it like it's hot. Because it is. <laughs> Mm. It is so good. Please, if you ain't tried the hot sauce, go buy his hot sauce. It is awesome. The best vinegar bite. I love it. Bring that heat. And it kind of, the more you add, the you know, the better your food gets, the better that heat gets. Yes, baby. Cheers. Mmm. Oh, wow. That was so good. Now, this mole is, I get the Donna Marie mole. Um, and they have it in like the chocolate mole. They have the uh, mm. my god, that's just <laughs> tongue popping good, baby. <laughs> yeah, so they have the chocolate standard mole that everybody sees, it's called by Don Marie. But they also have a mole verde, which is bacon. And basically, it's so easy. It comes in a jar and it's concentrated. And then you got to add water. And this one, I add probably about three cups of water. And then I put the mole in there, and you got to break it up because it's like liquid. It's like an oil, and then it's got you know powder in there. Or not powder, but like a paste. And, uh, put you some chicken bouillon, put you some beef bouillon, put you some seasoning, 
but nothing hot because well, besides the hot sauce. But I mean, you don't put nothing. I did put a little, uh, what do you call it, uh, Creole seasoning in there. I did my go-to Creole seasoning by Tony Satteries. I did my Cavenders. And then I did my uh, barbecue camo that I got. But anyways, diluted it down, seasoned her up, and uh, then I put like two or three tablespoons of peanut butter in there because it helps fortify that flavor to where it tastes like you freshly just made it. Baby. <laughs> it was good. I'm going to put some ball. His lips is good. Go get you some. Look at my pinned comment. You're going to see the website where you can go get that, go get merch. You know, go buy you some holiday stuff, honey. Be good to yourself. And once again, thank you very much, lips. Such an unexpected surprise. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -mm -mm. This is so good. I got me a little uh, turkey skin. Yeah, the nice thing about this turkey, it didn't take too long to cook. I actually uh, broke down the turkey. I took the legs off, I took the thighs off, I took the wings off, and then on I turned the breast upside down and on the backbone, I cut that in half, and then I pried it apart, and that kill bone kind of chopped it right there, and just a little split, and then just broke it a little bit to where it was flat, and put it on a sheet pan, and then a rack, in the oven, honey. Yeah, I know. I'm getting professional over here. <laughs> well, she pan the rack, and uh, come on, get it, get that back. Sorry, y'all. I'm being stingy today. I'm hungry. Hmm. Yeah, and it didn't take no time at all to cook. Now I can do me some stuffed turkey legs. I can do me some uh, some other things with the other meat because even two breasts is a lot of meat at once. Plus, I wanted to make something different, you know, with some different flavors, you know, different flavor. I'm thinking about doing some. Um, Maybe some, uh, you know, if you've seen the video I did with the turkey leg hot, why it was smoked and stuffed with uh, fettuccine alfredo shrimp. Baby, if you haven't seen that video, please go back and watch it. It is awesome. And Turkey Leg Hut is in Houston, but I don't live in Houston. I live in Round Rock, which is a suburb of Austin north of Austin, uh, over by Georgetown, but anyways, uh, ooh, look at that cheesy McCheesy po. I, uh, kept seeing Yummy Bites do that <laughs> turkey leg thing, and I'm like, man, I just got a hole make it. <laughs> OMG. Look at that. Cheesy, cheesy rice pool, baby. Mm. So, I'm thinking about doing another one, but instead of, yeah, look. 
<laughs> Chase Po. Instead of smoking it, um, I was thinking about frying it, doing like a chicken fried turkey leg. So, <laughs> mm. but anyways, I mean, turning that around. This rice is so good. This rice is, uh, hopefully I can see the food better with this tray. I'm loving this little tray. It's a lot easier to eat. I think I spill less on myself. So. But yeah, sugar, go get you some. And don't be scared, get you that extra hot. Mmm. Which I don't know if this one's the, the spicy one or the regular one. May have to get him to make me a special blend. <laughs> but it's so good. I like it. I like sauce where it's not too hot that where you can enjoy your food. Cause I got some that cap saying. <laughs> if I want to get jiggy with it, <laughs> I can pull out that cap saying. But no, it's perfect clips. Love it. Hmm. So good. So, so good. Yeah, it's got all kinds of peppers and stuff in there. Mm-hmm. He fortified it with that good ingredient. Mm. This rice is so good. This is just regular buttered rice with some seasoning and then I put the turkey drippings in there. Mm. Just bump that flavor up. Bumped her right on the Anyways, what do y'all eat with me? True. Or what are y'all snacking with me? I don't know, it's gotta be something good. Who cut that ice cream out? <laughs> I know, it's so funny. I love to eat ice cream when it's colder. Like, I eat more ice cream in the winter. I eat in the summer too, but it's just like, it's so funny. And I've been loving those Dollar Tree. They have the uh, Butterfinger ice cream. It's like all swirled up. Oh my God. The <laughs> Oh, real good. Excuse me, y'all. Hmm. But yeah, I just made a little simple meal today. Sometimes the simple meals are the best. Hmm. I don't know what I'm going to make tomorrow.
Of course, we'll have leftovers too. I don't know. I guess you just gotta wait and see. Because you never know what you're gonna see over here, baby. You'll never know. Mm. Mm. Yeah, this molly bird is good. Have you all seen my uh, uh, molly bird a pig ear sandwich recipe? The same molly that I used on the pig ear sandwich. Mm-hmm. Because the one thing I do about molly is like I make it on the side. So I cook my chicken or turkey or whatever you need it on. Turkey is very popular for mole. It's very traditional, turkey is. Also, uh, they also have a mole rojo, which is a red mole. And then um, they got the chocolate mole. And then chicken is usually traditional. I don't know if they have I seen beef mole or not. Be interesting at the research. But yeah, it is really good with this turkey. And this turkey, I just roasted her simple. Put my usual suspects on her. And a whole bunch of butter. But the number one thing is I peel that skin back. Just like I do my chicken. Peel that skin back and get that seasoning on the meat. Uh-huh. Not the outside. On the meat. <laughs> and then put the skin back <laughs> after it marinates. Or you're gonna cook it. But yeah, she came out nice and buttery. So lip smacking good with that hot sauce. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Mm -hmm. Sorry, y'all. I had to make room. <laughs> I got some acoustics in the kitchen. I mean, the living room. It was the dining room. <laughs> What's like the dining room, living room is one thing. Mm mm mm. So good. Oh. Really good. Good dirt nap after this one. <laughs> so good. My stomach is saying, Stop! Because you're full sugar. But my body, my mind, is saying, Keep eating. Because it's so damn good. <laughs> mm. So good. Really, really good. OMG. Mm. Mm -mm. Thing are looking good, baby. Thing are looking good. Look at that. Ain't it so good? Don't look tasty? Yeah. Alright, y'all. I am done. So, anyways. Peace. Stay true.
and you've been <laughs> burn bang, baby. And go get you some lip sauce, all funny. Go get you some lips. Look, look how delicious it looks. Look at it. So tasty. Tasty, 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 tasty. And I'll link it in the description so you have no trouble finding Lips channel. To subscribe, tell them Burn Bang sent you. As well as uh, to go to his store. Hot uh, sauce and some merch, baby. Until next time. You do you. I already know you're going to be the best you. And don't forget to inspire. Or be inspired. And never ever change who you are. Because I'm telling you right now, you right there are perfect. Just the way you are. Alrighty, y'all. Peace!